Luke, what are you doing? What are you doing? I'm walking around my house. Are you just doing what you're doing, please? I'm making pancakes of this year. Right, don't be rude. And why are you making pancakes? Are you joking? No, you're three. That's a perfectly legitimate question. What day is it today? Uh, Thursday? Nope. Well, I mean, it is. It's pancake day. Luca, pancake day was on Tuesday. I heard you lot. Sorry, mate, you're like two days late. <sighs> I can't believe this. I'm still gonna make the pancakes, Dad. Okay, but no mess, yeah? So don't call me Mr. Clean for nothing. No one calls you Mr. Clean. What? Now it's time for the big flip. That's not happening. Yep, one big flip coming right up. Luca, there is no way I'm letting you flip that pancake in this kitchen. Guess again, big boy. I'm serious. Do not do it. It will make a massive mess. Loosen up, one If you flip that pancake, there will be serious consequences. Swipe me down and not undo it. What are you doing? Hello and welcome to another video and today I'm going to be meeting up with my brother and we're going to be eating his student diet for 24 hours. Now those of you that are new to the channel may have never seen him before, basically he finished university last year and he has the culinary abilities of like a blind octopus. So yeah, it's going to suck. Now his train gets in in about 10 minutes, I need to go and pick him up. So if you are excited to meet him and then watch us eat like terrible food for the entire day, drop this video a like if you are new to the channel, subscribe and let's get to the station. Bernie! Hello. How's your trip, man? Yeah, good, good stuff, mate. Perfect conditions. Um, yeah, yeah. Um, okay, are you excited for this venture? Yeah, big time. <laughs> okay. Can you sum up your cooking skills slash experience in three words? Uh, I mean, that's a word. Uh, counts as a word, so you've got two left now. Pretty <laughs> <laughs> Excellent. Okay, that bodes well. I can loosely, vaguely remember, like when you're at uni, having conversations about what you're eating and being consistently disgusted. <laughs> but I don't know exactly what we're going to be eating today, so I want to leave it as a bit of a surprise. So presumably we need to go and get stuff, right? Unless you brought things to a bag like an absolute creep. Yeah, no, we need to go. We need to go shopping. Okay, <laughs> yeah, for okay. Sure. let's go to Sainsbury's. You join us in the milk slash yogurt. What have you got? Yogurt Isle of Sainsbury's. That probiotic. <laughs> this is one what of the are you most. Doing? These are, are genuinely. You, these are, are you seven years old? <laughs> right. <laughs> Absolute weirdo. What are we doing now, Ben? Getting some cereal, mate. We're good stuff. Textbook. That's a textbook breakfast choice. Right. He says. Absolute bargain. Ben's absolute trademark cereal. <laughs> Use the code Ben10 to get 10% off Wheatos. <laughs> if Wheatos are watching, or whoever owns Wheatos, I'm definitely on board for a sponsorship. Just putting it out there. What is wrong with you? Can you keep... How <laughs> have we lost two actors? Where's the other one? Right, what are we doing down this aisle, by the way? Uh, this is the most Fajita? important... Fajitas? Yeah, yeah, it's Fajitas. This is the most important ingredient in the, uh, in the meal, in the whole day, to be honest. <laughs> this is where all the calories come from. Uh, right, we want some good olive oil. Three quid. Obviously, the most calorific drink in the world. Basically, the best drink in the world, if you're bulking. So, done. yeah. I'm calling, I'm calling <laughs> the video off. This is done. See you later. <laughs> right, we done? Yes. Yeah, yeah, this is okay. breakfast. Sort of. To clarify, you have <laughs> Wheatos, Actimel and olive oil. Just wait and see. You're going to like it. Okay. I think I think you're honestly going to really like this. <laughs> All right. Hey, Ben. Okay. Yeah, what's what the matter? You you make breakfast, <laughs> Realistically, what we'll do uh, to like make it as efficient as possible, we'll go with shake and probiotic first. You yeah, couldn't so explain your weird... Right. This is, uh, this was like a big discovery for us. Because obviously we were bulking, uh, similar to Matt, like very high metabolism, hard to put on weight and stuff. Yeah, that's, These... that's quite important to establish that context. So, oh, yeah, while Ben was uni, for a lot of the time, he was doing an intense bulk. So Ben shares my insane metabolism, therefore we had to eat a stupid amount of calories to gain weight, right? Yeah, yeah, But yeah. on a budget, whilst being a student. So, that is the context of this diet. And all probiotics. So you crack these open. Yeah. They've always got, look, open yours. You'll see it as well, mate. See that yeah. gap at the top? Yeah. You know what that gap's perfect for? No, 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 you need Right, well, you've already messed us up. You're the next you just said crack it open. Yeah, crack it open. Don't tell uh, it. Uh, I'll perfect. just have the hard version. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So that little gap is perfect for a bit of olive oil. So it's up to the top. So do the same. What are you doing? On it. Mate, just try it. Just you try used it. to do this, Matt. Yeah. You used to have olive oil in face. <laughs> <laughs> to be fair, I. You probably, I, you probably did. This, this is where I got this from. So when I was powerlifting, again, <laughs> desperate trying to gain weight, at times I would, when I got desperate, I would put olive oil in my shakes. It's absolutely revolting, but like, it does. 
does. It's just the easiest source. Of yeah, well, that stuff. 50 mil is 400 extra yeah. calories. 100 like, mil. So literally, the tiniest amount of this is 820 calories. So you won't get a, an easier source of calories. It just literally sits <laughs> at the top. That is absolutely. And that's why you keep what? the lid on. Keep the lid on. Look, then put the Show lid back. Let me see how high yours is. Okay, fair enough. <laughs> so you put the lid on. Get that little shake. I've got to get you. Give you skin, so don't worry about it. Exactly. And no hydrogenated fats. Your body Does will it process it. That's natural. not mixed in at all. And that's what are you doing? easy that's the worst. Drink it up, mate. <laughs> I'm trying to drink it. Just don't hold it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, it's right. not like it's. This will be surprising for you. <laughs> no, it won't. <laughs> It'd be surprising how quickly I vomit. Right. Well. <laughs> I used to do this. Not to that ratio. That's like a third of this thing is olive oil. Stop being gay, guys. Right. Wow. Actually, that was right. Yeah, that was actually fine. So, how many calories? Is that? I'm waiting for that to like hit me. That right, that well. was actually fine. Yeah. Now the shakes. What's gonna hit yeah. you? Mate? <laughs> how much would that have been? Wait there. Right. This is live, <laughs> completely real evidence of the fact that this is an incredible tactic. Hundred grams. That would have been about about twenty milliliters of oil. I think you should put a disclaimer in that you're not recommending people do this. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Before we proceed here, do not do any of this because right. it's not good. Like you would just get really fat. Okay. What's next? Is that the olive oil dung put away now? No, 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 no. We actually, like, genuinely, we actually need it. So, right, the next. How much thing, olive oil? Uh, well, as I said, I so I always struggle to eat lots of food and stuff. Olive oil, easiest calories in the yeah. world. With something like that, absolutely fine. So, as I was saying, like I normally, normally use full fat milk, right? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. But we haven't sure, got yeah. it. So. Yeah, I don't know what the point of uh, green milk is to be. So it's quite a lot of milk, by the way. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, I would normally not have this, the full version of this shake first thing before going to the gym, I'd normally have this and like okay. lounge around so like cry so like a couple so of hours. Why are we doing that? Uh, just to maximise the day, you know, you want to get the full experience, full student student Vulcan experience. Yeah, <laughs> so right. These are whey proteins, right, we'll put... This is just whey protein, yeah? We'll get some oats in as well. Yeah. Yeah. Where's the protein from, B? Obviously, brilliant my protein. Link, link in the description. Is that right? Correct. <laughs> Correct. What do you think, how can I save at least 35%, sometimes more? Just use the code Matt. Well, there you go. So, Get your own code, Ben. Right, yeah, yeah, my protein, Mr. My Protein. If you're watching this, could you um, could you sort me out? <laughs> Maybe uh, Mr. Not yeah, put sorry. protein on the table. What was that? Oats, oats and protein. Two scoops of oats, scoop of protein, and that's like <laughs> a massive thing of milk. Two scoops of oats, and then a scoop of protein. Okay, and then we'll top this up a bit. bit, <laughs> bit of the good Stop. Stuff what are you protein. doing? As if you would use that much. I'm not even just kidding. Oh, there's no reason not to. It's all right. Can you see that volume of olive oil? That is absolutely ridiculous. <laughs> With oats as well. <coughs> yeah. <laughs> all right. So get on tight. If that leaks, it's going to be the messiest thing ever. I don't know how many calories this one will be. What I would, what I would normally do is top this up with a bit of milk just to make it more like palatable. Because um, obviously, that's basically, you just don't want to be sick when you're at the gym. Because um, obviously, that's not good. <laughs> 300, 300. Okay, so I would say that is about anywhere from 12 to 1400 calories, I would say. So if you add in the that's probiotic. Right. By the way, that's incredibly dense as well. <laughs> so like, oh, just after having this shake and the yoghurt, you'd be at like 2000 calories for the day. Good start to the day. If you just have a massive swig, see how much you can get down in one swig. <laughs> and then what? Like oh, just bring back memories. I remember doing this, you can just feel, even if, even if you can take it immediately, like within a few seconds, you just feel the olive oil in your throat and you're like. Yeah, that's why goes. it's important to get all this other stuff in there. Like, obviously, it'd be fine drinking olive oil, but you can feel it in you, which isn't, isn't nice. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Right, not too bad, is it? Like, mm. it's uh, yeah. not to be, great, to be fair, but again, you've got a new surprise. Way better than I thought it would be, yeah. yeah. Way better than I thought. Like I'm saying, I like, think, this is what I, I would do. I think like. the oats, because they're like grainy, they kind of cover up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's a good hack. The oats kind of mask the, the oily, like, oil. Yeah. Like, Say, come here quickly. Come here quickly. Keep going, man. There we go. Come in. Say, come in, mate. You want me to try it? It's actually really nice. Lies. It was I've been listening to all of your It's <laughs> <laughs> just like a meter like, like a proper mouth, I have a proper mouthful. Come on, commit to it. It's not that bad, is it? I thought it would be way worse than that. What is it? You're just not used to eating oats. Uh, <clears throat> it's more like the thought like, of it. I keep just thinking about olive oil, it's making me feel sick. See, I'm, I, think it, I, like, I think it's pretty good. But, um, that's that's not like, right. That's now 2,000 calories, basically. Like, do you know what I mean? Like, that's so easy. And off we go to try. 
Yeah, well, we still actually got our actual breakfast. <laughs> okay. <laughs> That's um, a liquid aspect. Of that breakfast. was manageable, but I think, uh, yeah, a full shaker of that, I think I would show you. This is, again, this is quite, this is a pretty sweet trick here. Yeah. Classic Gee, student yeah. mindset. What are you doing here? You're reusing it. Yeah. That is absolutely revolting. It's full of weird, oily lumps That's of oats. Fine. <laughs> Is that a blizz in there? How much do you milk in that though? Huh? How much do you milk in Right, no milk right. In so this is why Weetos are, I don't know, close to like next level engineering. Like watch this. You're thinking, right, like, <laughs> Ben mate, you're getting no milk in here, no chance. It's the holes in the middle. Holes in the Weetos, yeah, mate. Actually. Whoa, Whoa, slow down there. Look at that. Come on. It's about, to, it's about to explode <laughs> over the top. Why don't I put the lid on it? What do you well, mean? You I'm really drink it. You've got to drink it. Don't yeah, but you, that's going to pour all over your face instead of tip it. You can get it through the hole, no? No. Yeah, well, it's could be a new can. dimension. Yeah, yeah, he's probably yeah. right, actually. It's like a Weetos shape. If you try and pour that Weetos shape, it's going to it's gonna cover your entire face. Yeah, that's what I would normally do, but this is a new dimension. I'll grab some kitchen rolls. It's an absolute mess. Oh, hey, Luca. What are you doing? Uh, we're drinking olive oil and probiotic yogurt. Can I try some? Yeah, it's a good combo. Okay. We this, is, this is in a protein shaker. Yeah. Are they going to come out? I don't think they're going to come out. So what? You're just drinking milk. You're, yeah. you're going to end up with a whole thing of dry Weetos. Normally, I would literally, the first few, I would bite off, like eat them, would just like go at it, and then I'd get the spoon in there. So you're not like doing it. Spooning out of a cylindrical thing is incredibly inefficient. Uh, yeah, but I don't know. So it's cleaning. Maybe it's not a lot of dishwasher, mate. Yeah, we don't all have dishwashers. <laughs> I, do, I, I do, to be fair, so it's not really, not really a valid point. Yeah, mate. Right, that is a terrible <laughs> vessel. That is literally, if I was to design the most annoying vessel to have cereal from, that would be it. Show me how you go about that. All right, so you get a spoon, as, as you know, like a normal person. Yeah, but that's just, you've just got wheat over there. You don't want any milk. Press it down, mate. How much you can press it down as well, that's quite impressive. Weetos, I'm telling you, mate. This is the future. Give it a few years' time, this will take off like TikTok. <laughs> the guys at Weetos HQ are sitting back watching this video thinking, get this guy on the team. Weetos collab incoming. That would be great. Can you orchestrate that? Can we get that? Make that happen? Who owns Weetos? Do you know? Weetabix. Isn't it? Probably Weetabix, mate. Ryan McDonald. Can I solve it? Can we... What? Yeah, what? Yeah. You know what, Nick? Do you know how many calories you've had? Feeling all right, innit? Yeah, I feel right. actually feel fine, yeah. I remember it being way worse than that. What are you doing? I was spooning out the I was same eating thing. Weetos out of a protein shaker with a spoon. <laughs> yeah, why are we sharing this? Yeah, I know. A bit weird, guys. A bit weird. <laughs> I mean, this is a bit weird, the entire experience. What has not been weird? What's been normal about this so far? You got cold, by the way. Not anymore. I have. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm gonna start drinking it now. There's <laughs> like oily bits of Yeah, to be more. better, there would have been a bit of oil in there. That that <laughs> okay, <laughs> breakfast is done. That was weird, but to be fair, not as bad as I thought it would be. It's gonna be the most calorific breakfast you've had in about three years. Yeah, a long time. A good two years, I'd say. Right, let's get a bit. Update, we're outside the gym, it's cold. Really cold. <laughs> okay, so session wise, um, I have to squat today. Ben, because he's a lazy goon. I mean, technically not. He did squats like two days ago. Yeah, my first, the first squat time. Session, yeah, so in no condition to squat. So I'm going to squat. Ben's going to bum around. Then we're going to do back and biceps together. So is you in on that? What are you doing right now, by the way? Why are you crouching on the floor like an absolute golem, squeezing lemons into your weird shaker? You're a creep. Okay, let's go and train. I'm all in. Brody on the line, I'm tapping in. Got out here pulling the strings for me. A girl on the line, she feeling me. You power by the motivation. Put in the time, pay the entry fee. Bro on the rise, yeah, he kind of... Nice. Inside of my mind, no one's real as me. Lately, life has been gorgeous. Wake up the clip. Got my eyes hit recorded, praise up to God, I ain't chasing no bitch Swinging and miss, got me hitting these licks I get the orders, don't get it distorted Disconnected, I've been calling, I've been calling Squats been... are done, um, and I felt terrible I thought I'd feel good today, like last week was, a, was an easy week Because being in um, Spain, so in theory I should have felt sick today But I didn't, so that's a lesson in life The lesson being, I don't know, life is depressing Ben, feeling good? Working hard? Yeah, pretty knackered actually, I might just call it that. Okay, so that's the uh, leg necessity part of the session done. We're gonna, we're gonna do some fun stuff, so back and biceps. Yes, yeah, 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 yeah. Let's begin. Don't want I gotta hold up, but somehow I want more of it. Yeah, I want a tour and put on for the soil. Hey, bruh, remember they used to ignore us? Now they drop me the pin with the cord and they catch me running through the ordinance. Remember, we couldn't afford the whip. Pushing the scraper, that shit was so ageless. We blowing on grapes for the flavors. All of a sudden, we major. Still independent, but no label. For now, I'm going hard enough that the streams will lead to a house by the beach. All of this done with the speech. Filling my pockets for now.
now I'm belated I want the picket for some sign of the neighbors I used to skip out on the payments Now they's a tax for the neighbor Dog on the line, you ain't tapping in I'm staying clear, fake rapper friends Kamikaze on the traffic cam Only one shot to navigate the labyrinth I'm keeping it late, burn it down to the ash My life ain't much more than imagine I got where I'm at with the passion Training is done Cool Big time uh, Ben, why were you wearing this weird, creepy Wrist, motorcycle, flying glove I Just love it, it's kind of nothing No, I recently dislocated my thumb Well, actually oh, yeah. what happened is Matt dislocated my thumb yeah. To be more specific Wasn't towing the lines there had to Yeah, exactly. no, When we were skiing actually, Ben <laughs> We were skiing, right? <laughs> I went around a corner and stopped at the edge of a cliff. Ben just went, <laughs> plowed straight through me over the edge of a cliff. I thought he had died. He managed to like catch his thumb in the ski pole like yeah, handle like grip strap. Strap, yeah, and it like yanked his thumb out. And his thumb was like out here. So it's pretty sweet. Yeah, <laughs> no idea. We found fancy. some crazy like <laughs> ski mountain doctor who just put it back in, like retracted it, and now yeah. back in the game. And it's quickly training wise, your training's been quite sporadic, hasn't it? Like yeah. the last year, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, well, I've, I've been, so after I graduated, I I had to go into like, the real world and basically as a result did not really have time to train at all. Uh, yeah, go crazy mate, go for it. Um, and basically didn't train at all, didn't really eat properly, wasn't really, like the issue for eating properly for me is getting enough calories and I wasn't doing that so I was gradually losing weight, not training, getting weaker. I haven't deadlifted in like a few months, yeah. squatted once. But that's it, it's all about to change. Yeah, as of yeah, now, Ben yeah, is yeah, back exactly, in the game. Yeah. Operation make Ben friggin massive exactly, is yeah. in full operation. Um, by the way, I felt fine. I was convinced after consuming <laughs> a copious amount of olive oil, I feel sick, but I actually felt fine. Yeah, that's, that's what I'm saying. Like, so honestly, like, that's what I was doing every day for like two, three years. So, yeah, yeah. that's not ideal. Either. <laughs> okay, lunch. Uh, what are you saying? Uh, Macca's, mate. It's got to be. Okay. The classic. There's only, one, only one option. I'm happy with that. So, begin. By the way, just why was that so close <laughs> to my head? Wearing leggings and squat shoes when you forget your trainers and trackies, that is not ideal. I always go to take it because it's easier to carry it over. Oh, you're going to want it to be more. Okay. Yeah, we'll do that. This is a helpful helpful tip for anyone that. They don't know what to damage the environment. Right, so. Grand Big Mac. Grand Big Mac. Are you going to leave all the stuff in there? No, 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 no. I'll take the pickles out. Yeah. That's and the, everything in. No, no, no. i just take the pickles out. Oasis. Big Mac sauce, not ketchup. It's more calorific, man. Goodness sake. Yeah. You've clearly misunderstood what my like, angle is here. <laughs> Definitely no drink. Alright. Oh, Alright. Ready for this. Let's do it. Okay. Grand Big Mac. That's definitely yours. So we've got a Grand Big Mac each, and we've got one, two, three, four cheeseburgers. That's a really satisfying throwing a cheeseburger. Just throw it on my face. Like, like, what are you doing? The concussion. <laughs> then we've got large fries. Okay, so this would have been a typical student meal for you. And that's quite Obviously expensive, fun. though. Yeah, for the calories. So at the end of the day, firstly, Grand, Grand Big Mac wouldn't have been in there because it's not involved in the deal. True. These would have been student cheeseburgers. They would have been free. Yeah. Free? Yeah, you get free student cheeseburger with every meal. What the hell? Yeah, it's why I, I did my degree. Yeah. <laughs> By the way, a key point that you might just see skirting in at the edge of the framework. <laughs> Lean forward right now, sis. Oh, yeah, you. Let's see. Right, it. right, says, is in McDonald's. <laughs> Eating her own homemade salad out of a lunchbox. <laughs> that is the most dorky thing I've ever seen in my entire life. I mean, to be honest, this is absolutely ideal. Yeah, you're welcome, mate. I think that's the best meal so far, but like, goes without saying. Off camera, Matt was bigging up that shake earlier. <laughs> he was like, get, yeah. get me some more of that. The olive oil acting I think was so good. <laughs> Any thoughts before we start, Ben? I'm actually just pretty hungry, so I'm quite excited. You're right. Three, two, one, go. Okay, I'm no, sure. no, no. <laughs> I'm all for saving the environment, but these straws are really annoying because as soon as you start using them for a while, they get like right. all smushed up and you can't use them anymore. Ipso facto, be more like Sears and bring a lunchbox of salad to McDonald's and then problem solved. Calorie wise, that would have been quite substantial, wouldn't it? That would have been like 1,700, 1,800 calories. Okay, so I've got 1,800 calories each macros. for lunch, plus an enormous amount. Why did what? Just give me a bit of lemon. Mm -hmm. Refreshing. Your micronutrients in. <coughs> so, including. <laughs> including the um, olive oil, etc. for breakfast. I reckon calorie-wise, we're seeing quite a good number. When you're bulking, for the majority of the time, what would your calorie target roughly, loosely have been? Like five to six thousand. On a good day, I get six thousand. If we're like drinking or something, it'd be like four to five. Okay. Now we're gonna go home, uh, probably wrestle for a bit, and then catch you in a bit. Right, guys, what's the plan? The plan yeah. is that we're gonna buy some more food. We were gonna go home, and we realised that we're right next to Sainsbury's. 
So we're gonna make our second sandwich trip of the day, get some supplies for some kind of snack probably, and then dinner. Food acquired. And that was definitely like one of the weirdest food shops I've ever done. Um, see you back home. Back home. Some time has elapsed since we last spoke. Um, we had planned to eat like earlier in the day. Um, like it's quite late now, but I was full after McDonald's, but I felt okay. I was fine. And then like after a couple of hours of just sitting down, I just started feeling sick. It was like a delay reaction to like the up to you, oil consumption. My <laughs> stomach was like, what have you done? Anyway, uh, Ben, what is this? <laughs> so. Unlike it, I mean, eating pot noodles is like, to be fair, pot noodles are quite nice, right? Yeah. But they are a bit weird. Right, well. How to make it weirder, get two of them and put it in a protein shaker. So, right, so I think pot noodles are really nice. I feel like everyone agrees with that, like you said, you know? <laughs> <laughs> what are you doing? Then talk us through the. <laughs> Mate, get out of it. Talk us through the construction of this incredible snack. So yeah, two, one pot noodle is nice, but it's not enough calories or anything really. So get two of them, put them in a shaker. Why? What's yeah. sorry? What's the? That's fine. That's what's the shake? What's to put in the shaker part? Well, because you don't want to eat. Two, basically, if you have two pot noodles, Just unavoidably there. one will be a good temperature. The second one's gonna go cold. You can't do two separate. You're gonna. What are you gonna do? Two trips to the kettle? A, a no. bowl? A bowl maybe? A, nah. You're living in the past, mate. You got. I'm not look, living in the past. I'm living in a world where that is really annoying. <laughs> also, are you washing your shaker at some point in the day, or just using a shaker for every single thing you eat? Yeah, That's disgusting. Yeah, yeah. So you got like oats, right. oil, and then pot noodle in your shaker. Yeah, yeah. Always use Still the same. Pot, no, pot, what pot noodles are these? Uh, Chinese chow mein. Which is the blue one? Like the light? No, wait. Not the lightest blue one. The light. For, for the pot noodle connoisseurs out there, it's like the middling. This is a classic, mate. This is like a snack, yeah? Yeah, 800 calories, like 10, for almost 10 grams of protein. Yeah, 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 so that's 800. Almost 10 grams of protein, that's terrible. I'm gonna try and drink it. Well, that's the good thing about this, you know the liquid, you know the noodles are, you know? <laughs> it's gonna be like, absolute mess. Okay. This is going to end up being a gigantic mess, so I'll finish these and then catch up with you when we're starting to plan dinner. Welcome back to another episode of Cooking Disgusting Food with Ben. <laughs> um, pot noodle was about 20 minutes ago, I'm not going to lie, I'm feeling fairly sick now. Like, I'm not that full, yeah, yeah, but it's like, got a weird underlying, I mean it's not it's weird a because... a lot of mass, but again, loads of calories, so yeah. cheap bodybuilding okay. 101. So what I feel like now is a really high fat pizza based meal, so excellent. Ben, what's happening here please? This is my go-to dinner for basically the entirety of my stay at uni. Uh, so what we do, obviously I'm not having four at once, but you'd have two together. So what we'll do, we'll get these all in the oven, get them cooked up to a good level, and then there'll be a bit of assembly to make the official meal. Phase two, Ben. So, get some grated cheese. Pre-grated. I mean, do. cheese is already quite a prominent whoa, whoa, whoa. ingredient of a pizza. My stance, right, and I think this is pretty <laughs> much agreed by everyone, is oven pizzas like these always come with absolutely no cheese on them. Like, it's always a, a joke amount of cheese. So, I always just like to chuck some more cheese on it. Because this is an important layer, because this is what's going to keep the sandwich together, you know? Get on with it, mate. Why are you dragging this process up so much? So it. Excellent. If I was going to rank like the items I'd like to <laughs> eat now, this would be a factor in that league table. So in case anyone's not clear, Ben has got two pizzas, put some cheese in between them, and then made them into a ginormous pizza bat sandwich. These are pepperoni pizzas, by the way, just to give you a little cross section there. Two pepperoni pizzas with more cheese made into a sandwich, and then a beer. Or not. This is absolutely Are you ridiculous. ready for this? Excited? No, absolutely <laughs> not. Why, what, hang on, what are you doing? How are you eating this? It's a sandwich, mate. Same as you would in the other sandwich. You know, just go for it. Just get in there. You, you can fold it if you want to. Uh, they're like 800 each, I believe. So 1,600 plus the cheese, 1,700 to say 1,800 calories, thereabout. That's a bold statement. When you get the crash, you just get an enormous amount of fat. <laughs> like a massive of home. Looking classy, guys. Looking classy. <laughs> Down it. Actually, quite nice, like to be honest. It's a lot, but it's just good. There's so go. much fat. Like I, mm. I would frequently eat this many calories, but it's just so much fat. This is like an enormous amount of fat to consume. It's like keto. my stomach. It's like a keto. You're shaking. Then you're a fat shake. shake. Uh, my stomach is <laughs> <just> <laughs> so close to the end, but I go. 
really want to eat anymore. If you finish it, I'll finish it, but I'll just ruin it. I will not do that, guys. Oh, come on, you're almost done now. Mm -hmm. Yeah, smell it. <sighs> Three, two, one, go. Oh, what are you trying to say? Three, two, one, go. It's a dramatic countdown. Uh -huh. I meant three, two, one, go. Eat the last bit. Oh, okay. I'm I'm two in a minute. Okay. I feel like I'm not really in any condition to form a coherent sentence now. So, yeah. Well, CB, thanks for giving me disgusting food for the entire day. <laughs> yeah, no worries, mate. I hate you. Close yeah. the door. I'm locking it straight away. <laughs> okay. Uh, Ben's gone <clears throat> to get his train. And I'm gone in an emotional, psychological sense. I feel so sick. Like, what the hell? It was a, it was like a good amount of calories, but I've eaten that amount of calories and more numerous times. But like I said, I can only just, I can only assume it's just the accumulation of fat. I just stomach feels so bad. Like, let this be a warning. Like, I, I know, particularly in the past when I was bulking in a really aggressive fashion, and people say, oh yeah, we just do like a dirty bulk, and like you know, if you're a hard gainer, eat loads of like calories, just get them in. However, like to an extent, that does work maybe as a short-term fix. And like I said, if, if if you're struggling to get in calories, sometimes it is a, a viable option. But there are definitely short-term and long-term like implications. It's not, it's not an optimal way to do things. So I wouldn't advocate it at all. Because like I said, I feel friggin' terrible. And on that depressing note, we're gonna end the video because like I said, Ben is gone. So that's my content gone. Um, yeah, the conclusion is that it was bad and I do not want to do it again. And it's just reminding me how grateful I am that I'm no longer bulking because that was a friggin' tough time. Anyway, that's it guys. I hope you enjoyed this weird video. If you did enjoy it, give it a thumbs up. If you'd like to see more Ben in, uh, involvement, more Ben action in my videos, um, which I'm definitely keen to do, then give it a, a thumbs up as well. If you are new to the channel, subscribe and I'll see you tomorrow.